everyone! Welcome back to my channel. For those who are new, I am Jasmine. I am a mummy from Singapore and have a son named Elijah. He just turned one year old this January. In this video, I would like to share with all of you the activities that I have prepared for Elijah. And the theme is none other than the very hungry caterpillar. Why is it so? Because this character has been Elijah's favourite since the day I introduced the book, The Very Hungry Caterpillar by Eric Cowell to him. Before I share with all of you the activities, do subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification button so that you don't miss any of my videos. Let's move to the first activity. So this is the caterpillar's head and you can see behind is a basket. This toy will go together with a basket of fruits. I've actually ordered the realistic ones from China but then they haven't arrived so I will just make do with this. So for this, Elijah will place the fruits into the mouth like this. We will also talk about colours. So red, green, orange. And we also talk about the name of the fruits as well. We go orange, banana, yellow banana, green, green apple. Oh. Yeah, so this is how we play with this. The next activity would be this one. This is a box which I've recycled. So I made um, a caterpillar here and cut some holes. If you open, there are pom-poms inside. They are of different sizes and different texture. You can see this one has like some stuff on it. Yep. So how Elijah play with this is that he will... Sometimes I will put it like this and then he will poke. Yeah. If not, he will just put this inside on his own. Okay? <coughs> The next one is a tub of food that I've handed for Elijah. Um, so when I read the book to him, I will hold a caterpillar like this. And then I will say, on Monday, he ate through one apple. Then I will string the apples into the caterpillar. On Tuesday, he ate through two pets. So I'll do this. One, two. Sometimes when I'm not reading to him, I will just pass him the whole tub and then he will just uh, pick the food or the fruits from here. He will just squeeze and then he will touch the texture and I allow him to do so. Um, of course, when he's older, I will reintroduce this toy to him again and then I will try to let him practice stringing it by himself. The next one is a birthday cake. The next one is the birthday cake. If you have not watched my previous video, do watch it because I show how I made this cake. And then I'll tell him that this is one. This is Elijah's first birthday cake, one. And then we talk about um, what food that we see here, like ice cream, cherry pie, the fruits, orange, strawberry. And we will talk about the colors. So we go like blue, red, yellow, dark blue, red, like this. The next one is an art activity which we have completed already. Okay, let me show you. I will show you the video of how he did this, alright? actually just a soft toy itself and then I hand make the wings. I use a pipe cleaner to attach the wings together with the caterpillar and then when I read the book to him I will say this okay now the caterpillar is not tiny anymore it became a big fat caterpillar. He built a small house called cocoon around himself like this he stayed inside for more than two weeks and he became a beautiful butterfly. <laughs> the next one is a magnetic whiteboard. 
I use colored tape to take the flowers and the leaves. And then I have this realistic looking uh, butterflies, which has a magnet below. And then I just place it on the board. So Elijah will observe the butterflies patterns. And then sometimes he will just uh, pick up the butterfly and then he will drop it. And then he see that the butterfly attached to the board. Yeah, so some magnetic play here. And I thought it's quite interesting. Um, the next one, we have the egg and the ball in the cup. Because we learned about egg, right? So, and I also want him to practice his skill. So I included this in. So he will place the egg inside and the cup in, and the ball inside the cup. Like this. Next, I have... A posting activity. So inside this container, you see cups. These are the fruits that um, can be found in the book, right? So Elijah will place the cards inside. I didn't want to get random cards because I thought if I can make it educational, why not? And then, um, I mean, even if I don't read to him, he can just look at it. And he can recognize them because he eats them. Okay, next one is this toy. This is a caterpillar and Elijah will turn the knobs and then he will see the whole thing. He loves this. So for the next one, we have this. And if you remember from the Christmas video that I've shared, um, I actually rotated the puzzles because previously Elijah could only remove the puzzle pieces. So right now I want him to practice removing it and putting it back. I've changed the images so you can see that this is a butterfly and this is a caterpillar and I have the exact um, figurines to match yeah okay so for the next one we have a rainmaker so this is part of music Okay, so um, I thought this looks like a cocoon, that's why I introduced this. And this is my favorite, I actually love this a lot. Okay, so what Elijah do is that um, sometimes he will roll, sometimes he will just push and he will topple. Okay, for the next one, is this one. Also from the Christmas videos, you can see that um, I gave Elijah toilet rolls to put it through, right? So this time around, I gave him something like this. I gave him the green and the red rings. And then he will try to place it in by himself. And this comes together with this color card as well. So sometimes you'll do matching. So the next one is this. You can see that uh, this is Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. And then on Monday, the caterpillar ate through one apple. So you can see one apple inside. And this is made by metallic foam. And then this is Tuesday. The caterpillar ate through two pairs. These are furry. On Wednesday, three plums. These are felt. On Thursday, four strawberries. These are glittered foam. Very nice touch. And on Friday, the caterpillar ate through five oranges. And these are orange pom-poms. Very cute. Elijah likes to pinch this. And then on Saturday, the caterpillar ate through all this. So we'll just talk about the pictures. And Sunday, the caterpillar ate through one nice cream bee. I use a pack cleaner to make into a shape of a leaf. And these covers, um, I collected them from Elijah's wet whites. Yeah. Okay, and lastly, let me show you the book wrap. Okay. Okay. So here, you can see some Chinese book and English books. For the Chinese, I have this. Tai Tai Shi De Jia. So this is a flower, right? And then when you open, it's a butterfly. 
蝴蝶的家。This one it says, 猜猜谁长大了？嗯、um, ，In this book you can see this. 毛毛虫长大了，它变成了蝴蝶 ，butterfly. And then, uh, this one, 猜猜我是谁？ So it's very cute. So you see this part, right? This is part of the flower. And then when you open, you see a butterfly. Yeah. There's also some cards because Elijah likes to just take the cards and then he likes to look at the cards and then he likes to fold the cards and stuff. So I just give it to him. And then um, there's colors. There's also numbers like one, two, three, four, five. There's um, fruits like orange. Um, Caterpillar, mama chong, butterfly. Yeah, so it's everything that um he learns. Okay, so everything related. And then here I have um books of different colors. So you can see red color, right? So it has everything red. So we'll talk about you know like red handbag, red chong sum, red alarm clock, red red uh photo frame, red butterfly, red strawberries, red capsicum, and then there's also green. Okay, example like green pepper and green pear. Okay, so on and so forth. And then here I have the giant, the very hungry caterpillar book by Red Cow. And I also have the Chinese version. It says, 星期一他吃了一个苹果，可是肚子还是好饿。星期二他吃了两个梨，可是肚子还是好饿。You know. And then we have this buzzing mellow. This is a sound book. So when you press this button, that sound. And then in this book, you can see um, butterfly. There's also this one, monsters in my garden. So here you can see, oh, there is a monster in my garden. No, it is a caterpillar. So it shows like this is the head. These are the legs. A more realistic picture. Okay, and then I also have a Chinese book. Okay, 想飞的毛毛虫 So it shows how the caterpillar grew and become a butterfly. And I have this book given by um, Elijah's best friend, Elijah's baby friend Adam and Auntie Wan Yi. Yeah, for his birthday. So the caterpillar, the butterfly, and at the back there are many figurines of the characters, and Elijah loves this a lot. Okay. There's one which is not related, but it's Elijah's all-time favorite, so I leave it on the book rack. Uh, I love this piano book. Why? Because this is so easy to follow. Let me show you one example. Okay, old MacDonald, right? So these are the color uh, notes. So you just go like this. Easy to follow, right? Even music noob like me can do this. <laughs> Maybe Elijah will think that mommy is an expert, but actually it's not. Okay, anyway, <laughs> yeah. So this is um our favorite book. So it's always on the rack. Right. Okay, so I've come to the end of my sharing. I hope that you enjoy this uh video of mine, and do remember to subscribe and do turn on the notification button so they don't miss any of my videos. Alright, hope that you can support me. And with that, I see you in my next video. Bye bye!